maybe I should try to get them evaluated. I don't know. I still don't know what that looks like. I'm like, okay, still scared at that point, but I signed them up to get an evaluation. But what I did not know was <laughs> there's about a year waiting list for an evaluation. One year. Yeah, you heard me one year doing this to wait any longer why would i wait a whole nother year if i've already waited all of this time nine months came and i get a call saying oh i had someone drop off the cancellation list for a family of two are you available are you still available to come on this day or this day i'm like oh yeah we waited long enough we'll be there i don't care what's going on i'll cancel all plans this is priority we'll be there so the basis of the evaluation was you have a pre-evaluation with the with the pediatric psychologist which mine was virtual over the phone they were asking me what does sage and saint do how do they play how do they interact how do they communicate how do they let me know what they need how do they communicate with others? How do they play with others? How do they eat? What are their gross motor skills? Can they go up the stairs? Can they tie their shoe? Brush their teeth? All these different things. It was a lot. It's just an appointment for a preview of what will be shown when you actually go for a in-person meeting with the psychologist. It also, they wanted this was on my laptop they wanted to see how they played with each other so that part was cool and I got a chance to voice my concerns and fears frustrations all of that at that first meeting so about a month later was the in-person meeting now in person the appointment was about three hours you can only come in the morning and you can only do one child at a time because I have twins. So we had two separate days. Funny about this day, I don't know. I woke up a little later than I would have and it's basically rushing, there's traffic. I didn't even like put on a cute outfit or nothing so I was just looking crazy. We get there and I don't know. The, I don't know, I guess I was just tense. I was nervous about the situation because the psychologist was actually gonna tell me that day what the outcome is and everything else from there. So, going through the evaluation is just like, your child is gonna get a set of instructions. You cannot help your child at all when they are being evaluated. You can't mention anything you can't help them this is all to show what they can do focus on what they can do not what they cannot do but what is gonna stick out to you is what they can't do because you already know what they can do put the boy on the bridge put the boy in the car put the car under the bridge you know all these different prompts they have to do and when you see your child isn't doing it at that very moment when asked. It was definitely a wake up call like, okay, we have a lot more to work on. Even though we have progressed to this far, like there's, we have a lot, a lot to go on. And this appointment will explain why we haven't progressed quicker. I, <laughs> Saint was fine. Saint was first. Saint's point was first. Saint was fine. I had to take a break. I went outside and I cried. Saint was just like, Saint was in his own world. I went outside, I had to do some deep breathing. I called a couple of my friends and they were just very reassuring. Like, you are a great mom, y'all will get through this. You got it, like, <laughs> don't be. <laughs> don't be afraid don't be ashamed you know and i'm like okay i gotta i have to recoup I have to recoup for saint because i have to be clear and level-headed like but it was just like i don't know it just it felt different felt different so we go back inside and finish the evaluation we go back 
and finish the evaluation, the psychologist is like, yes, we are going to diagnose him with ASD. At that point, they're gonna refer you, depending on your child, they're gonna refer you to some other therapies maybe, and you go on from there. That was day one. Remember, I have, I have two kids, so day two. I woke up extra early, I'm refreshed, I felt good about going. We go in, knock Sage out, he's diagnosed. Okay, boom, we got it. So, cause we waited, that was a year. We, we waited a full year on the waiting list. I hope I can help you be comfortable with the process and accept the process. So if you want to learn more, please like and subscribe to this channel and make sure you hit that ding bell so you can be notified when I post my next video. Christina out.